Two uh, one, kind of some missed opportunities for you guys today. Well, we we certainly missed some opportunities. They did too. You know, I mean, they had some opportunities early, and we had some in the middle part of the ball game, and you know, weren't able to, to execute uh, offensively. And then uh, you know, the big pick off at third base. You know, for me, uh, you know, that's as much on our, our base runner as it is anything else. You know, you can't get picked right there, and uh, you know, you got a tying run sitting there in the seventh in pretty good shape with a chance to drive them in with two outs to go. So, uh, you know, unfortunately we, we missed some opportunities. And then, uh, you know, a couple things, you know, their two run inning, they got a two out ground ball up the middle off the pitcher's glove, deflected enough to where we couldn't make a play. And uh, then in the ninth, Thorburn hits one up the middle and, you know, it gets off the pitcher's glove, but directs right to the second baseman. And, you know, they're able to make a play and finish finish that one. You know, otherwise that's the leadoff hitter on in the ninth. And, you know, maybe we get a chance get a chance to tie it. Kind of the way baseball is sometimes. Yeah. Every once in a while, one goes your way. Sometimes it doesn't. Sometimes, you know, and, and today unfortunately it didn't. You know, we, we swung and missed too much. You know, we 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 swung and missed too many too many breaking balls, change ups, and really weren't strikes. You know, we chased too much, but. Uh, you know, we've got to do a better job and have a little better plate discipline and, and certainly better balance so we can see the baseball a little bit better than what we have up to this point. And what did you think about Evans' performance starting for you today? You know, he hung in there. He, you know, he battled, he battled through some command issues and, you know, he made some big pitches when he had to after two, you know, back-to-back -back walks in the first and then two men on no outs in the, in the second. And, you know, he was able to get uh, get strikeouts in the first inning and the second inning and strikeout to pop up and got us out of it. But, uh, you know, he settled down and, and threw the baseball better, I thought, the fourth, fifth, and sixth. Uh, had a little better command of his change up and his breaking ball. He didn't have a breaking ball for the first four innings. And with you guys, you have scheduled, you know, a, a very difficult schedule starting off with a uh, Kentucky, Virginia, and you come out here and you get Big 12 team and a couple of, uh, S I mean, West Coast Conference teams. Unfortunately, didn't get to game in with Cal. But what was your philosophy going into to scheduling this and playing on both coasts? Well, you know, our philosophy, schedule philosophy, is trying to play the best schedule we can play year to year. Uh, this year, it just so happened the way it worked out. You know, with Kentucky and Virginia VMI in our opening weekend, uh, you know, we, we wanted, wanted to run a tournament that weekend, and, and we had the opportunity to bring them in. And, you know, coming to the West Coast uh, was something that uh, Coach Hill and I had discussed a couple years ago. If they came to, to our tournament last year, mm -hmm. we'd come back this year. And it gave us a chance to come out to the West Coast and, uh, and get to a different area and play quality opponents and, and give us a pretty good indication, of, you know, where we are right now and what we've got to do to get better. And how do you feel that you are right now? You know, I think we're I think we're really close. I think you know when you're playing quality opponents, all the games are going to be close, and, and you you have to minimize mistakes. And so far, you know, you, you've got to minimize mistakes. You've got to execute offensively when you have opportunity to move runners. And you know, we haven't done we haven't done as good a job as we need to up to this point as far as moving runners and and executing offensively. Defensively, I think we've gotten a lot better over the last uh, five or six games, which has been a plus. But, uh, you know, we still have we still have a walk or a hit batter, or, you know, where uh, in a situation where, you know, we can't afford one. And it seems like the top of your lineup has really been carrying you guys. Uh, Dick has been, you know, tremendous for you uh, in the middle of the lineup. But how do you get to the bottom of the order to, to start making some contributions? Well, hopefully, you know, you know, we're still we're still trying to figure out exactly who needs to be in there. Uh, you know, and the ones that are have been in there, you know, they've got to continue to make some adjustments. Some of those guys are younger guys. Of course, two of our youngest guys are at the top, and, and Golden and Thorberg, and those guys have have bought into a, a solid approach at the plate, and and been pretty good for us. And hopefully, you know, down toward the back end, we're we're going to eventually get that out of some other you know some other guys.